Hey everybody, this is Hunter Carey. This video is going to be on the proper clothes to bring with you hunting for all the different animals and seasons. Alright, so what I have is I have them all labeled out. Accessories, turkey hunting slash bow hunting, some more turkey hunting stuff. And I don't know if you can see that, but that is more turkey hunting. And over here, I have my deer hunting, my gun deer hunting stuff, all in boxes, and there's my underclothes. So let's <coughs> start with the accessories. Always, I always bring my with me a fanny pack. It's got just the simple things in it, a knife. I like to put my small caliber ammunition. These are just 22 rounds. And my hunting license. In there. And just some extra food, you know, just in case you get hungry. There's some gloves up here. Always got to keep it with you gloves, especially in Wisconsin where we hunt. I always bring extra pairs of gloves. This is a turkey hunting mask. You want to keep this for turkey hunting because... Unlike deer, turkeys can um, actually see in color, and they'll spot you right away. There's another fanny pack. This is for fishing. I don't know why it's down here. Tags. Extra broadheads. Face mask. Deer calls. There's broadheads in this box. This is a windicator. There's, there's um, some cooking powder I think it is in there and all you do is you flip this little thing up and you press this and it squirts out the the uh, cooking powder and it blows it in the direction the wind is blowing so you can tell all right now this is my turkey and bow hunting stuff got some long johns always need long johns to keep yourself warm some pants camouflage pants this is my Under Armour. I love this stuff. It's super warm. This is cold weather gear. This is for towards the late bow season, more like in the fall. And I'm sorry, you guys, but this is going to be a long video, so bear with me here. This is the cold, or this is the warm weather stuff. As you can tell, it's a lot lighter than the cold weather. Warm weather, cold weather. I bring myself a little bit of reading material, even though I know most of this stuff. It's just keeps me entertained. More long johns, sweatshirt, and these socks. You always need wool socks when you're going out because wool cotton is does not keep your feet warm. Always bring a pair of wool socks. Up in here is just some extra jackets, camouflage jackets. Bow hunting, and when you're bow hunting, you don't want some thick layers either, because you got to be able to pull back your bowstring. And if you got big bulky clothes on, it's harder to pull that bowstring back. Down here is just some extra, extra sweat pants and stuff to keep you warm. There's some camouflage pants. That's pretty much done with the fall and spring stuff. For bow hunting and turkey hunting. These are just some lighter, <coughs> excuse me, blaze orange jackets in case winters, like the past few winters have been pretty uh, warm, but this one's been just brutal. In this box, there is just some gloves and hats. Extra gloves, extra hats. And what I like to do with my stuff to keep it smelly and natural and not smelling like a, um, a house or like the city is I put some pine boughs just off our Christmas tree and um, into that so it smells like pine all year until hunting season. This stuff is just insulation. Extra, extra warm. I love wearing this stuff. It keeps me super warm. It might look stupid, but who really gives a shit when you're out in the woods? It's not like you're and be a fashion model or anything. Uh, for gun season, I bring out this bag. 
sent away. I use this for bow. Gut gloves, I always need those. These things are just amazing, these hooahs. Field towels. They don't have any smell to them. And it removes odor, grease, and grime. Very great after you're done gutting out a deer or something. This is just um, special golden estrus. This brings in the buck. Had a big one come in last year for gun season. Nice buck. Nice 11 pointer. And if you're not going to be sitting in a deer stand, you're going to want one of these. Nice tripod chair. Sit down in it. It's nice and pretty comfortable. It could use a back, but it's all right. And these, I had just actually made. I should have made a video on it. These are just some shooting sticks I made out of an old tripod that I had that I was never going to use. Spray painted these. You stick the barrel of your gun right in here. These are adjustable too. This pulls out after you loosen that, but I don't really feel like doing it. And of course, my bow is back here. I don't really feel like getting that out. These are gun cases, you know. Just the simple necessities. You don't need the name brand stuff. I mean, whatever works, works. And just remember to check out my channel for more uh, how-to videos and other stuff. And remember to subscribe if you if you like my videos. Thanks for watching. Oh, <laughs>